Hello and welcome to a new video. I'm Foxtan Solele and I'm glad you're here. What I'm doing today is a Ecoline watercolor ink illustration um, with a serious message <laughs> in a way or with a recommendation. Um, the whole inspiration behind this um, painting is to unclench your jaw, which is very important, especially if you are getting stressed or if you are stressed. Um, it's very important because it can really damage your jaw in the long run also mentally it's not very good and it can also cause some headaches so if you see this and clench your jaw and just relax for a moment think of something nice <laughs> and then continue on um actually this issue has been one of mine since like years and i once had a um, dentist tell me to stick up some little dots um, around my workspace where I can see them often and whenever I catch a glimpse of them I should just unclench my jaw and just relax. Um, it really helps if you keep conscious of it and it can become an unconscious thing too where immediately you will just um, relax your jaw but it also takes time so if you want to start on that it's, it's a really good idea and i hope it helps you out um <clears throat> but until then this little video i hope will help you relax a little bit um i kept in some of my real-time footage for this Actually, quite a lot of it is still the real-time footage, as you're seeing right now. Um, I thought it would just be fun to have a little, um, a little less speed in one of my videos and just um, focus on the process, making strokes, applying the um, watercolor ink and just... Um, watching it just come together also in this video i especially really like how my um, rainbow makers made the uh, little shine um, shines of rainbow on my paper um, i think that's also very relaxing <laughs> and i have quite the serious collection now of um, rainbow makers on my window just because I really enjoy the effect especially um, if it's sunny outside and you wake up and you just see all those rainbows it just instantly lifts my mood so if you like rainbows I highly recommend getting you some crystals that reflect the light in your window um, because I think even just those small things in life can really make a huge difference of how you approach a day and just makes your life a little bit more fun. Um, and as I said for this illustration, I've been using some Ecoline watercolor ink. I've been really enjoying using them because they are so stress-free to me and they just work together and they flow well, they make beautiful gradients and the contrast between them is also really nice and they are just um, easy to work with and I really enjoy that recently, um, especially because I've been feeling exceptionally drained out and burned out too, just from life in general. So. Making these carefree illustrations is really um, necessary for me to continue on with my work and stuff. And I hope they are not too boring for you to watch. 
um, if they are, I'm sorry. I'm sure I get back into a little bit more entertaining and bigger illustrations. But for now, this is where I'm at, and I'm really enjoying doing these smaller and relaxing illustrations. Um, the colors I chose for this were just some complementary colors. I really like the pink that I've chosen in contrast with the uh, greenish blue or bluish green um, that I've later chosen for her hair. And uh, I really like how this all came out and it just... Whenever I look at this now I will just remember to relax and unclench my jaw and just take better care of it um, and I think if it helps you just for this moment to relax a little um, then I'll be glad that I could help
Also for this um, painting I've decided to try some old brushes again. Like um, I used a Menzo brush for the hair details and all. Um, let's say lining um, brush and I really enjoy using it because you can get such an easy variety of line with just one brush and it's really fun to do the outlines with it. Um, later on I also used a striping brush for some of the outline and the fine uh, lines you can get with it is just really amazing to me. Um, I also tried a um, a nib for this illustration just because I wanted to figure out if that maybe would work but in the end I felt I had more control um, with a thin brush than a nib so that's what I went with mostly but yeah finishing this piece adding some small details here and there and adding shading to the hair is just really fun to me and I hope you enjoy watching this process of it
And as for the final colorful details, um, what is it? Details? I think details. Anyway, for those parts, um, I used a Sakura jelly roll um, in a few different colors just to add, to add some little sparkle and more of what I think makes my illustrations me. Um, all the colorful stars and a little bit of an opaque medium. Um, I think it really makes the look of the stickers quite uh, real, as if I had used real stickers. Um, also using the neon um, pink on the um, text itself really made it stand out to me and I had a lot of fun just going over the sketch with it and making it stand out more. Also the choice for the color pink was because I thought it would just really contrast well with all the uh, green blue in the hair. Um, just to make the message a bit more clear and stand out. Um, and then the last part for me was basically to just add the um, piercings and the um, braces on her with a Molotov liquid chrome pen. Just because I was too lazy to get out the liquid chrome or liquid silver I have by Vallejo. Um, and that is about it for this illustration. It was really fun to create.
So after I added all the final white parts, um, just wanted to say I hope you enjoyed this illustration. I hope you could relax a bit and I hope you think of unclenching your jaw a little more sometime. Um, I would really appreciate it if you would leave a comment and a like. Also subscribing really helps me out and I hope I will see you all in the next video. Um, bye bye!